The reason why I kept an interest in um, natural, natural medicines from the land is because that's what I, I was raised on. So I grew up with my mom and dad showing us um, things. We didn't have a grocery store or a drug store that we could go to. We had information passed on from our grandparents and I remember going out on the land and harvesting the things that we needed to keep ourselves healthy. So it just kind, kind of came natural to me that I was interested in harvesting medicines off the land. Even now, today, the strongest medication that I take is probably extra strength Tylenol. So um, yeah, once you're raised with it and your belief system is connected to that, it's hard not to uh, continue on with it when in your adult life. Uh, which really explains why I keep an interest in it. The spiritual part, the emotional, mental, and physical all have to be connected in order for you to be healthy in adult life. And what I do say to them is First Nations people believe that the health and wellness of a person is uniquely interwoven into all aspects of the human body, in mind, body, and spirit, and is deeply connected to the land. The health of Adena people is rooted together within the land because the land is the nurture of our people. The land provides everything needed for our physical health, for our emotional well-being, and provides everything required for spiritual sustenance. Everything in the land is there for us to be healthy and to be able to survive and live in harmony with the universe. The mind, body, and spirit of a person needs to be maintained, kept balanced, and in harmony with the land and its occupants, the planet, the plants, animals, and humans, each depending on one another and needing each other for survival. I really would like to have more of our people interested in, in harvesting and acquiring their own, but it's more easily convenient for them to go to a grocery store and pick it up than to learn about it. But I definitely am proud that that knowledge was passed on from my grandparents to my, to my parents, to me. And then I, I have the opportunity to pass that on to my children.